bringing you the news and information you need from the people making a difference. This is Comcast Newsmakers. Well, we've heard that ignorance is bliss. Just how bliss is it when you put your hand on that hot fire? Uh, they say knowledge is power. And how important is knowing that even with our budget? Hello, everyone. I'm Joe Basikia, and this is Comcast Newsmakers. John Shore is with us, the president of New Jersey Policy Perspective. Let's talk about knowing as much as we can, including what he calls the invisible budget. Good to see you. Good to see you. Accountability, uh, being able to be transparent. How is that all in the true sense so crucial to democracy? Well, you know, whether you think the state spends too much or too little or something in between, we should know more about it. You should be able to find out every penny, every dollar the state uh, spends so you can make honest decisions as a policymaker, as a citizen about what we should do in this state. Can you do that now? No. What we want to talk about today is something that we just did an interesting little pamphlet on. We call it uh, the invisible budget that hides uh, spending choices. Because in New Jersey, the state budget will tell you how much money was appropriated to pay a salary, to pay for a program, to buy something. But it doesn't tell you how much money is given up through all kinds of different tax breaks. It could be a business subsidy. It could be how much we don't get because we abated somebody's property taxes. More than 40 states every year put together what they call a tax expenditure report. Fancy name. It basically says you can find it through the pages of this book. You can find every dollar the state didn't take in. That's just spending by a different name, and we don't keep track of it in New Jersey. Full disclosure, you are a liberal think tank. You have this um, policy perspective here. Uh, how can people get a hold of it, by the way? Well, this is on our website, www.njpp.org, and we'd ha be happy if people would come get a copy of it because it's going to inform people. This is, this is not a right-left issue, a Democrat or Republican issue. This is accountability. This is how much do we really spend on these things. And I'm not saying necessarily they're bad things to spend money on, but if we knew about them, then we could make really good choices. We know New Jersey's in a huge financial hole right now. Part of it is because a lot of mistakes made over, over the past few years. And part of that comes from not disclosing what we're up to, not allowing people to make choices. So many folks get so frustrated because they don't know what to believe. You know, coming off that last election with the ballot question uh, about the uh, trying to disclosure in terms yeah. of allowing the, 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 the decision to, before borrowing. Uh, and, and then people twist it around and it means this, that, or the other, uh, one way or the other. How, how do we know who to believe here? Well, you know, facts are subject to interpretation. There's no question about that. But with something like a tax expenditure report, at least everybody starts with the same information. You can draw your own conclusions. You can say this tax break is a great thing. You can say it's a bad thing. But at least you know who gets it, how much money it costs. And we don't have that in New Jersey now. You said about facts. It's also, too, uh, could be that the devil quotes scripture. You know, it gets really <laughs> right. tricky. But uh, your, your message here right from the get-go is, hey, we need to know as much as we can garner. Well, I'll give you an example. Um, in, in Pennsylvania, they don't have a sales tax on clothes, just like in New Jersey. But they know how much money that costs because every year they put out a report. New Jersey last announced how much we don't take in because we don't tax clothes 11 years ago. That's the, that's the figure we're working on today. So that's crazy. That's not a way to run a state. What happens next, John? We want legislators to pass a bill that says New Jersey every year must produce a tax expenditure report, like more than 40 states do. I think California was the first one. They started in 1976. The federal government does it. We want New Jersey to pass a law that says you've got to put this report out every year so we can make intelligent decisions about where our money goes. Are you optimistic? Yeah, I am, because I think there's, a, there's an openness now to, to these kinds of things. There's more pressure for accountability and disclosure. Uh, we're so out of money right now, people want to keep better track of what we've got. And how important is it, the public, because there's going to be expenditures that we need to make. Uh, the more we know, sometimes we may be less apt to say, okay, let's go and spend it. Well, you sometimes, know, the, you know the, public, the, the elected officials may feel like they're up against the wall. We're certainly facing budget cuts, and they're going to be severe, and they're going to hurt people. So, you know, the better idea we have on where we actually spend the money, then we can decide better where to cut, where to raise revenue. Maybe some of these tax breaks should be terminated. Maybe some of them should be extended. In some states, when they do their report every year, the governor says, I, I have found this, this break doesn't do what we said it would do. It's not providing help for the people we want it to. We need to know those things in New Jersey. Accountability is always important to know whether or not we should proceed the same way or differently. It sure can't hurt. It's always good to see you. Pleasure. He is John Shore. He's the president of New Jersey Policy Perspective. What is that? It's a liberal think tank in the great Garden State. I'm Joe Basicchia, and this has been Comcast Newsmakers, seen exclusively right here on Comcast Cable. Thank you so much for watching.